Being the first athlete at Chestnut Hill, um, the first field athlete at Chestnut Hill to win a conference championship feels monumental in my career and within the history of the school. Leading up to championships, I decided to get my mind right, do a lot of meditation, do a lot of self-reflection, and make sure that my mind was clear and positive. When competing, I try not to worry about everyone else. I try to just worry about what I'm doing, um, because when I worry about other people, it tends to get in my head a little bit. So I tend to just talk to my other teammates, make it more like a practice environment where I'm comfortable and not worry about the stage that I'm going. In the moments leading up to my final throw, I wasn't nervous at all. I knew that I had it and that I was just, I just had to have fun with it. But I didn't know that I would break the record by eight feet. That was, that was a little bit um, surprising. But I felt great. I felt clear. Being a dual sport athlete in the same season and also a dual sport student athlete, it was very much time management that went into it. And that I was a student first before I was on any team. So making sure that my academics stayed true to myself. This past three months really taught me a lot of adult skills that I will use the rest of my life, which I'm very grateful for. I will go into next season more experienced more comfortable, definitely more comfortable. And my goal is to just continue to get better and represent Chestnut Hill in a very good way.